get away, can you? Um, I've never done a Facebook Live. This is a little bit unusual. Um, I wanted to talk to you guys about something um, that I'm really excited about. Uh, I've been, to give a little bit of background about, my, about myself, um, probably a lot of people know, but I grew up in a really small town. Uh, it's called Hagerman, Idaho, and I was a park ranger. That's right, wore the green pants, went up to my belly button, little ranger hat. But the neat part about living in a small town um, is there's a lot of farmers and there's a lot of ranchers. And my family was fortunate enough to have a freezer full of beef, um, of quality, quality beef. Um, uh, it was grass fed, you know, just all that good stuff. Cause I honestly, I kind of thought everyone that's where you buy beef. <laughs> honestly, I thought, oh, you just get it right from the butcher. But as I grew up and I had a family of my own, oh, note to self, never have gum when you do a Facebook live. Um, when you have a family of your own and you're like trying to be mindful of good quality in your bodies. Um, you look at the types of fruits and veggies you're eating and you also uh, need to be mindful of what type of meat products you're putting in your body. And so I've done a lot of research. My, my um, little girl, Matley, shout out to her, uh, she suffered from a lot of allergies. It was pretty rough for a while. And so you know what what really got me was inflammation um, that was that was the name of the game was figuring out inflammation and so I've always had a really um, I've just always um, researched things that helped with pulling back inflammation and help with um, things that are non-inflammatory so I found this amazing company and I'm gonna show you this box I'm wondering if you guys are even trying to guess what this is. Um, can I go? Oh, I don't know if I can even show it. Can I flip it around? Oh, here we go. So here's this company. It's called walkingtbeef.com. Well, that's not what they're called, but that's their... Anyways, it's, it's so amazing. You can order beef straight from this company. Um, and it comes in this box dry ice and I'm just this is the first time I'm pulling it out so you'll get meat like this wouldn't that make your husband so happy and it's frozen solid everyone frozen solid because it comes in dry ice so it's all packaged up um, this was ordered just three days ago and I was able to get oh my goodness so much amazing amounts of meat and you can see how it's all packaged up just like that um, the thing that, that I'm really excited about, because I was researching for a long time, trying to find how can I get, because when I go, I go to any of the big warehouse stores, um, some, some of them are decently priced and some of them are outrageously priced. But when I started doing a lot of research, um, I found out that when it says grass fed beef, it doesn't mean that when they were from when when they they were babies, so baby calves, that they weren't um, grass fed only. Often, what happens is you have someone that raises the baby calves on grain, whatever they want, and then it goes to auction, and then those other people will come in and they'll finish them off on grass. And you know, and so it's very interesting. Um, the big thing about this company too is it's antibiotic free. Um, it's no growth hormones, um, grass fed, and it's, it's actually, they finish it on, um, grain fed at the end. So it has a nice marbling effect. But the interesting thing is it's not just pieces of corn, like grain fed, what you picture, what cows would have. It's actually like the whole stock. So it's what naturally cows would go and feed and get really healthy and strong. Um, so let's see what else was I going to say because I'm really excited about this. Um, the last thing I want to bring up, oh, so a couple years back, 
Um, I actually, and some of you that watch this might even have been part of it. So I was really wanted to get it on a budget. And so I ended up, we ended up all going in on it on a, like a quarter cow and a half cow, whole cow. I don't know if you guys have ever done that. But it's kind of a pain trying to get everyone together to be able to, and then you'd have, we'd all meet at one spot and we'd be able to get the beef. So you have to really coordinate with people's time and money. Um, this company, you go and you order and you could get your subscription where it's every two weeks. You could get it once or twice a year. Um, there is no commitments with the subscription. This is not Beachbody. This is not, you don't have any auto ship. Like you can, you just subscribe and you could have amazing beef to your door. Cause I've worked with it where you have to call the butcher and it's a pain. And I've never seen a company where they're part of the calving. I don't know if you guys know any ranchers or farmers. It is incredible. The amount of care and selflessness and the, just what they do and I love supporting people like that because I feel like it's kind of a going away trend and you know I just think of like you know the cold winter nights and that's when you know in like February remember last year when we had so much snow guess who's calving guess who's having to go out there in the middle of the night um, this ranch is from they, they've had it from the baby ma the mamas and then the, the little babies all the way up until um, it's time to time for the butcher. And so these people, they have been part of the entire process, except they don't they don't do the butchering, but they um, they even will package what they're sending to you. And this is I've never seen a company like that. I just think it's really incredible. Um, if you can get anything that, I mean, your gut health is so crucial. I mean, that's, that's why I'm kind of getting on here is I'm just so passionate about whenever, when, when my family went through health struggles, that's what pulled me in was like, I've got to figure out this gut health. And when I saw, when, when I researched and found, let food be your medicine. And it is, it is important when people say, Oh, well, I could just get it at the store. It's the same thing. It might look the same, but it is entirely different. Um, when you look at, um, you know, I one thing that is really difficult is antibiotics when we have to take them so frequently, and we all know what can happen to our guts with that. Well, when we eat meat that has been, that the animals aren't take, well taken care of, and they're given antibiotics and um, fed GMO <laughs> grains and all that. That's that's the type of things you're you're eating. So um, you can tell I kind of really like health and fitness. And I don't know why I said fitness. I guess we went cow tipping we went, when we were in high school, right? Um, but yeah, I seriously go check it out. It is such an amazing. I mean, it's. I think you'll be very, very impressed. I know I was blown away by what what quality of meat you can get. And at the convenience, I mean, really, if you've ever tried to buy beef that way, it is so difficult. So anyways, thanks guys for listening. Bye. Oh, now how do I turn it off? Oh, finish right there. Bye guys.